हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू ई कॉमर्स प्रोजेक्ट इन लारावेल टेन लास्ट वीडियो वी डिस्कस हाउ टू शो कार्ट पेज इन साइड लाइक अ कार्ट आइटम मीन्स अ प्रोडक्ट आइटम इन दिस वीडियो वी कैन अपडेट द कार्ट मीन्स डू यू वॉन्ट टू गो टू कार्ट एंड आफ्टर डू यू थिंक ओके आई नीड टू अपडेट क्वांटिटी सो हाउ यू कैन डू इट अपडेट क्वांटिटी सो आई विल एक्सप्लेन इन दिस वीडियो यू कैन स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो सो बिफोर यू आर न्यू इन दिस चैनल अदर इन दिस सीरीज सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब एंड प्लीज प्रेस द बेल आईकॉन so whatever content we are uploading so you always get the notification and you can start immediately new thing learning and also do you want to buy any scripts so just go to our official website errorsolutioncode.com and you can buy inside script menu any script and also do you want to develop any coding related works so just contact like a telegram whatsapp and skype and we are always prefer skype okay so let's start now so first of all we need to open our coding part so let's make a minimize i go to resources inside you can see it like a uh, our uh, payments inside card.blade.php let's make zoom out not minimize and just scroll down so here our form there like uh, buttons there update cards so first of all we need to change like a a link to button okay and here i will type like a type is equal to submit we don't want to need anything here okay and also here there like a coupon code we don't want to use here form so just you can remove this form and here is a button so you can put like a type is equal to button okay once we can develop about coupon coupon code after we can think how it works so right now you can remove the form and here also you can remove the form okay so now we can go up and we can start our form so let's minimize here like a uh, tables and also you can minimize like cards so just you can start like a form and here you can do again form so it's very simple here you can type like actions and uh, now here provide like uh, our url url and you can type like a uh, update cart and here we can use like a uh, post method Means method is equal to post, and we can do here the CRF token. So let's go to any page, and you can copy for the CRF fields. It's very simple, very easy. Okay, now we are starting our main work. What we did, we created buttons, and after we create like form and coupon code inside, we are removing the form. So let's copy this name, and I can go routes inside web, and just scroll down so you can see it like our cart. So just copy paste above line here. and you can change here like get method to post method okay is very simple now you can go to payment controller inside you need to create a new function like a update cart functions update carts here you make a request dollar request let's go to scroll down here and here you can make <coughs> and here you can do it like a dd request all okay so what information we are getting so we can understand so here i will always save like update cards and his post method and here is a form let's go back again and we can save the data let's go back and just click on the update card so is required let's remove the required because we don't want to need right now required coupon code so just scroll down let's go up because i made a mistake here so here is the button so here required you see so this words you can remove here our cart items so let's go back again refresh the page and i click on the update carts so it's working very well only token found now we need to go like a, this is the quantity whatever is there and also we need to go like a, is id so how we can do it inside a array i will explain now So first of all, we need to use here key. So you can type like dollar key inside cart. Okay. Otherwise, do you want to create your own variable like i? And inside you can make like i plus plus. So also possible. But always I will prefer like this key wise. Okay. Just scroll down. Here you can see it like an input box. You see, type is equal to number. And here is the maximum you can put like hundred. Whatever do you want to do, you can do it. Okay. Here is the ten. There I have sent out hundred. so when to provide here name name <coughs> that cart 
first we need to create an array like that inside we need to pass our key like a plus plus mine plus plus like eight seven one two three whatever there this is the key and key after we need to provide like a name so here is the name is a qty okay it's very simple qty i save these files and just go back refresh the page and click on the update cart so let's see so you can see cart array inside you can see seven and five so you can see it is working but we also need id like key is automatic work like here is a using the id device key work but we can do it inside id so simple just go back again and you can copy all thing and you can put here and here we can do it like hidden field also we don't need a class and here you can change like a id cart inside id available min max we don't need so just you can remove and also we don't want to need like required fields just remove and here you can change like a id so this value also i get like a id cart inside a key and also his name is equal to id okay let's save these files just go back again and refresh the page so you can see it proper way let's click on the update cards so now I will open this area so you can see it like quantity there ID there I see I told you is a key wise work like key is also is ID but we don't care whatever there is a key we can create is a own array wise otherwise do you want to use here I so also possible okay so here is work done now we need to work here so what we can do we need to open our plugin so just go to composer.json and you can copy the plugin name okay a cart and just you can search in google so all you found first link and go here inside the links and you can search like one words like a update like a, i can search like a update uh, update sorry spelling mistake update why i make a mistake update i let all okay just scroll down so you can see it like update here okay just scroll down still so here update here update so you can see it like a update on item cart update so is the multiple facilities means a functionality available do you want to update the price do you want to update the direct quantity do you want to update like directly like a whatever product there like a quantity is a four another you can add so it be, it will be six quantity and here also same like logic there but I will prefer this one whatever quantity here there inside form this quantity into work you can read this note so you can easily understand as you can see by default the quantity update is related to it is a current value means whatever value you are adding inside a text box so this value you can see it just copy you can go back again and you can paste here it's very simple very easy okay now we need to here create a one for each loop and here i can type request is a cart you can see it here is a cart there i just go back so you can see it cart area okay so this is a looping wise and i can create one variable variable like carts and inside we need to pass this data And here we need to pass like a id like a four five six there so just you can pass like id because id working as a array so don't type like a objects like this this is the objects work like a you can see it and this is the array you can see it here you see array okay so id pass and also you need to pass our value means quantity so here you can go back again and you can type like a qty and just you can make return redirect back and it is done no anything else let's save these files and just go back again refresh the page okay so let's add three quantity here and here two quantity and i click on the update cart so you can see it like a 300 and here you can see 6 and 16 so is a 120 suppose i can make like a 3 so you can see it like a 118 here you see 
one eight EA three hundred. Here is the different different update available. Suppose I will use this. This is the one. Okay. Just go back again, and you can put here. Do I need to explain both one? This reasons. So you can understand easily why I am did this one. Why I am did not did this one. Just copy and paste here, and also you can copy and paste here. And let's comment out. Okay. So let's go back again. Refresh the page here. And here is a three quantity. I will add like a four. So four plus three means seven quantity here. You can see it once I will click because of before is a three now is a four, and here you can see it like a six quantity. You can see it here six and seven means whatever there is updating direct your old one like a automatic sum. So this reason we need to work like a changing, replacing like whatever you did this one need means the relative is equal to false. You see it. Okay, so we don't want to use this code. So let's go back again and refresh the page. After you can just add like a one one, so automatic price. Do it like year one and also year one and click on the update cart. So you can see it is a whatever price there. This price you can see it. So it is very simple, very easy. Suppose you are read document, so also you can do it. Otherwise, I already explained how we can update the shopping cart like our. Update cards inside a quantity, whatever you can think means think your mind like this works. So I hope you are clear about like a update cards. Next video we can work like a admin side to shipping part, and we can work like a coupon code. And after all process done, after we can go to like process to check out. I know here is still not there, so check out inside I can explain how we can do it. Okay, I hope you can understand what I explain. And this is the coupon code. Also, we can move inside checkout page here. Not possible because we are page refreshing. So sometimes is a different checkout, different. So here not possible. Hundred percent. Always you can see it. Your Amazon, Flipkart, so always available inside a checkout page. But this design wise did here. So don't worry. We can just copy and paste inside checkout page. Okay. I hope you have a clear. So do you have questions? And also this is shipping charge. Also we can do it inside checkout page. Otherwise, yes, yes, hundred percent is a checkout page. We can do it here. Not possible. I hope you can clear what I am talking about. And I hope do you want to like about this video, like update cards, and do you want to see this video? So please subscribe and please press the bell bell button. So whatever content we are uploading, so you always get the notification and you can start immediately new thing learning. And thank you for watching Error Solutions.